Hey, so today's video is hopefully a little less sad than yesterday, so uh, I finally got some good weather here, and, well, good as relative, but good enough to fly, I thought, and I went out to fly, and I did manage to fly one battery down, <laughs> but uh, yeah, well, uh, when I put in the second battery in the spark, basically the spark started complaining about the battery being too cold. Um, uh, well, I can see how that goes. So I made it uh, back into the warm apartment um, after this morning's uh, drone flying session and uh, well I guess I'm trying to keep this video short here, um, going to fill it up with a bit of drone footage at the end so if you're into that uh, just stay or well fast forward um, but I'm not going to talk for long. Uh, basically just what I wanted to say is I mentioned that I didn't have good weather to fly before and um, if you follow me on Instagram you might also know why I would say something like that. Um, there is a small reason and a big reason behind that. <laughs> uh, the small reason is that um, and some photographers might actually disagree with me with this being small is the lighting. As you might know, I'm in Finland, and in Finland at the moment, the days are quite short, which means that if there is nice sunlight, then usually I'm at work. And here in Tampere at the moment, most days are, well, not with nice sunlight. They are mostly with a lot of clouds, which makes for not the nicest videos. Um, as I said, for me that's uh, the smaller reason. The larger reason is that um, uh, the, the exact same spot that I went to this morning, uh, I went to about two weeks ago, I think it was a Sunday as well. And why I was expecting it to be great because the sky was blue and the sun was shining. Uh, it's just the right moment when the sun came out. Um, I couldn't fly because uh, there was too much wind and that's, that's a real problem. Um, if you read those drone forums, uh, a lot of people got the drone for Christmas and they keep losing them left and right because they're not looking for stuff like the wind going or well, uh, they're calibrating them while they stand like next to a huge metal object and stuff like that. Uh, and I'm, I'm trying to avoid things like that. So when I got the battery warning this morning, uh, I decided, well, to stop flying. But yeah, generally, um, the main factor why I haven't been flying much lately was the weather. I can't fly when it's snowing um, because the drone, well, isn't safe for water. If there's too much fog, it will also uh, confuse the sensors. I did have a bit of a problem with the uh, with the very light snow. I'm not sure if you can see it in the footage. There was some very light snow going on this morning. I did have a bit of a problem where the drone wasn't always exactly precise, as precise as it is in clear weather. But it was manageable. Yeah, but in general, I don't want to fly in weather that might make me lose the drone. And especially if you're flying over a city like I did today, um, and you want to consider the safety of other people as well even if the drone is as light as the spark which is 300 grams you do not really want them they wanted to uh, crash down and slam them in someone's car or worse so uh, it makes a lot of sense to actually put a bit of thought in where you fly when you fly and when you don't even if you would really like to If you want me to talk a bit more on how to be safe with your drone, how to make sure it's not crashing, 
or how you do not put others or yourself or your drone at risk, uh, feel free to leave a comment below. Um, you can also recommend just to check the forums, uh, either the ones by DJI or what was it, sparkpilot.zone, something like that. Um, there's a lot of people who have been helping and trying to help, um, answering questions like that. And uh, if, I, if I see a question there, usually I will answer as well. But uh, I can make I can make a longer, more detailed video about things about how to scale location uh, and so on. I just don't know if anyone is interested. But you let me know, and I'll make the video. Enjoy the footage from this morning, and have a nice day.